The factory front and rear brake rotors and pads on your F250 or F350 four-wheel drive do a decent job of stopping your truck, but if you're hauling a heavy load or towing up and down steep hills, you need a sizable increase in stopping power for those times you need it most. Beginning with the front brakes, remove the two caliper bolts and pry the caliper off the rotor. Now that the caliper is off, remove the brake pads from the caliper bracket. Now to compress the pistons back into the caliper, we use one of the old brake pads and a caliper tool to push the pistons back in. Remove the caliper bracket next and pull it from the hub. The rotor might be adhered to the hub from surface rust, so a couple of smacks with a hammer will break it loose. Place the new rotor on the hub and bolt on the caliper bracket. Add some grease to the caliper slide pins and insert them back into the bracket while spreading the grease around. Add the new clips to the brake pads and insert them into the caliper bracket. Then slide the caliper on top of the pads. Bolt down the caliper to finish the front brakes. The rears are very similar. Start by unbolting the caliper from the bracket. Remove the caliper and take out the old brake pads from the bracket. We added the grease to the slide pins before we removed the bracket. Once the pins are greased, we compress the pistons into the caliper and remove the bracket. Remove the old rotor and replace it with the new power stop rotor. Bolt the bracket back on and slide in the replacement pads with their new clips. Attach the caliper back onto the bracket and bolt it in place. This full set of front and rear rotors and Z63 severe duty brake pads are a big step up from your factory blank rotors and stock semi-metallic brake pads and will give your Super Duty improved stopping power, less fade, low levels of brake dust, and almost no noise while keeping wear down to a minimum.